Keep him reaching for the bit. Maybe a little straighter in the neck. Keep your elbows bent, your hips under you, hind legs, take the hind legs, take, take, yep, yep, that's better there, keep them, keep the hind legs. Sit on your seat, lighten up your bridle. Stabilize your eye, walk forwards. Hands up. Now think collection as you come towards S. Collect and then the extension. Keep the energy in your horse. Collect, let go, get him under. More collection, more half steps. Just the idea of it. Okay, now you should be riding the working trot. Take the hind cord, it's good girl, good, good. Keep the shoulders. Reach towards his ears a little bit more, stay on your hips, yeah. Quicken the tempo. Quicken, keep that tempo. Yeah, keep that tempo. That's right. Keep your hips in the upward transition. Don't tip forward. Okay, so you go into the corner, then you cut the corner, and you're off on your serpentine. Stay on your hip seat, bend your elbows, be gentle, move the horse's shoulders exactly where you've taught, been taught to ride this movement. Yep. Stay on your hips. So you want to think collection and uber streisen. Your elbow's bent. Don't give him a, a hip change. Well done. That'll get better if you're consistent. Beautiful walk. And smoothly forwards. On your hip, not forwards. Superstar. That was a superstar ride. And think half steps, canter, on your hips, uber strides and uber strides in there. Then you can just get him really under again for the, your next movement. Cut your corner.
As you halt, don't let him move your hand down and you tense up your hips. You keep yourself seated nicely and correct forward. Be happy. Good. 